And now, from Minnesota's most watched station, this is WCCO 4 News. Well, concussions are a concern from youth football all the way up to the pros. But a Twin Cities high school thinks that it may have a method for keeping players safe while cutting down on head injuries. As John Lordson shows us, it's a new protocol that could turn into a big win for player health. It's 30 minutes to kick off at De La Salle High School, also known as the countdown to contact. The Islanders are wearing their usual black helmets, but inside those helmets is something new. When it blinks green, that means it's fully charged and ready to go. Head coach Sean McManamy has a new pregame ritual. That is Jamal. Installing what are called head case impact sensors inside his players' helmets. What it does is that it holds a file folder with every hit that kid has always had. Using 3M tape, the sensor is placed between the hard plastic of the helmet, and the sensor is connected to a phone app that notifies coaches every time a player takes a big hit. They measure the g-force of every hit to the helmet, from light taps to big collisions. And if the hit is big enough, the sensor lets the coaches know. What it does is just helps us monitor big hits and say, hey, you know what, uh, you know, Steve just got a, you know, just just took a big hit to his head. You know, pull him off the side and it's, you know, just check him out just in case. The player can be put through the baseline test on the app to see if they have a concussion, and it's all recorded as part of their injury history. Concussions is big, you know. We we try to keep away from it, and that's why this this thing can help us a lot, you know. It can help them literally keep their heads in the game. This, I think, is just another step, but it helps monitor the amount of hits that your head takes, and I think it. In long term, it only helps. The team received the sensors last week, and De La Salle is one of only 13 schools in the nation using this technology right now. De La Salle is part of a trial program, so there's no cost to the school.